On April 21st, the Friday before the launch of Linden Tongue Week, the McKenzie High School Alumni Association will be hosting a grand black tie red carpet gala. Like, subscribe, and share to Voices of Linden TV. We're so excited to have you join us here this evening. Uh, here in the studio in the Voices of Linden TV, we have joining us uh, Janelle and Matthew from the McKenzie High School Alumni Association. And they're gonna be sharing with us their vision for their up and coming gala reunion. Janelle, tell me more. Thank you, Armina, and a pleasant good, good night to everyone who's listening. Thank you, Andrew, for sharing this platform with us. Um, on April, 21st, the Friday before the launch of Linden Tongue Week, the McKenzie High School Alumni Association will be hosting a grand black tie red carpet gala and reunion in aid of the school's library. And we're inviting anyone and everyone who is going to be at in Linden at a time to come and support us. It's really exciting. And Matthew, tell me about the food, the vision, where it's going to be taking place. Hey, good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Matthew Bryant. Uh, I'm happy to be here to share with you guys uh, what we have planned for our gala uh, slash reunion fundraiser. So it's like a uh, black tie affair like none other before. Like Janelle would have said, it's red carpet, Sunday best, come out and support McKenzie High School Alumni Association. Uh, basically, we're going to mingle mingle a little bit initially after you mingle uh you're gonna sit down and have some dinner after dinner we're gonna boogie on down like we've never boogied before but it's a black tie affair not black clothing but sexy elegant evening of pure vibes and, and, and pleasure oh wow i can't wait to see it all come together now tell me how does someone go about getting tickets or actually contributing to your event Okay, so our, our event, because it's a fundraiser in aid of uh, projects that we would like to do for the McKenzie High School, uh, there's a, suggest, a suggested donation for tickets that starts at $50. So the suggested donation uh, of $50, you could purchase tickets on our website. Our website should be officially up and, and running on the 22nd of February. At that time, you could actually go on the website, click and purchase tickets. Even if you are not coming to the actual event, remember it's a fundraiser, you could actually come out or I'm sorry, you could actually donate. So you could go to the website and donate by purchasing the ticket uh, for the gala. Oh, that's absolutely fantastic. So with this being launched in February, at the end of February, you do have some time to start gathering the funds so you too can make an impact. So I heard that there is going to be something exciting also happening that night and that the students themselves have actually taken part in contributing to this. So Janelle, do you want to tell me a little bit about the silent auction? Yes. So we were having a silent auction and there are different, um, different things that you can, can get. Now we've asked the students in McKenzie High School Art Department to submit their absolute best work. And we want to support them by adding value to their their craft. So if you can come out and support and, and purchase artwork from the students. In addition to that, we're gonna be having other um, items to auction like travel items. I mean, we have about five destinations around the world. One of the biggest ones is um, for 12 close friends to go to Italy for 10 days. And if you just have $14,000 just hanging around anywhere, you know, amongst your 11 best friends, you are sure welcome to bid on those. There are going to be many, many other items for um up for auction, gold jewelry, trips to kite shore, and a host of other things. So come out and support us. Oh, you're making me want to go to Guyana. <laughs> uh, come join me in Italy, because I will be in Italy in May. So that's exciting. And Matthew, I heard that there is going to be um, like uh, music. What kind of music? 
so since it's a so since it's a reunion and a lot of us you know went to high school back in the day of course we're gonna oblige with a lot of back in the day old school music so you're gonna get some nice old school r b you know for the ladies and some nice old school you know dance hall and reggae and stuff like that and it's just gonna be pure vibes uh we're gonna transform the edward benjamin center into a, a building like none other you know with the ambiance and stuff you know and lights and all that stuff so just come out support us and have fun with your your peers your uh, classmates and stuff from back when you attended Mackenzie High School. Keep in mind, it's not only for Mackenzie High School students. As long as you get a ticket, you can get in. So basically, you're contributing to the Mackenzie High School. Exactly. And why should you care at home? The idea is everyone wants to make an impact somehow. And you have to remember that as much as we're focusing on Mackenzie High School, anything that that benefits the school also benefits our hometown that we love so dearly. So that's something that we have to make sure to remember. Remember, this not only applies to if you're an alumni or if you're currently attending McKenzie High School, but it's for anyone that wants to come out and have a fun evening, different from any other that's ever happened before and sticking with what the McKenzie High School Alumni Association uh, vision is, which is illuminating our past and brightening our future. So this is a fantastic way of helping to support something that's going to benefit you and everyone around you. But anyone who's coming to attend this event is going to be thinking of two things, food, food, food. <laughs> that's three things. So Matthew, <laughs> please tell me, how is it for someone like myself who has certain dietary restrictions? Uh, tell me more about the menu. So thank you, Armina. Uh, on, on this night, we are catering for everyone. We're going to cater for uh, if you're a vegetarian, if you're a pescatarian, or if you just want to be a carnivore on the night. And it's going to be mouth-watering because we're going to have uh, specialty chefs catering uh, for the event. And also... During the cocktail hour, you can get your hors d'oeuvres and, and that type of stuff. So you could mingle, you know, sip a glass of wine and, and eat some hors d'oeuvres, you know, so oh, that's. Wow. Really wow. You're making me hungry. So tell me, is it going to be an international kind of mixture of food or are we going to have some traditional things that are, I mean, Janelle, you haven't been home for what, 20 something years? Yes, ma'am. So I am so excited because going home is food for me, but we're trying to cater to everyone's palate, but we may mainly focus in on what we can source back home. And I just want to add also that all of our vendors are alumni, from our decorator to our caterers to the musician, everyone who is going to be a part is a part of Mackenzie High School community. So coming out to support the event is not only supporting Mackenzie High School directly, financially, but it's also supporting the community by supporting the small businesses that are owned and run by alumni from Mackenzie High School. So it's a really good mix of everything good and benefiting to the community. Oh my gosh, that just makes me melt because we're only as successful as the people that we bring along with us that are equally successful. Fantastic job, you guys, because it takes a lot of effort and planning to make something as successful as, it, as this one's going to be. Now, with that said, uh, I do want to share with everyone back home who are physically in Guyana that this is your opportunity to take a look in your home around for things that you know that you are no longer using, that you may want to contribute uh, to the auction so that we can start raising some, you know, some more money for this great event. The idea behind this fantastic event is to have and a reunion that encompasses everybody from the past and have a great evening of celebration. And uh, before I say good evening, I'm going to have Janelle and Matthew say a few closing words. Hey guys, so we want you to come out, come have fun, let your hair down and experience a night like never before, especially coming out of the pandemic. We need each other more than ever now. And we're looking forward to seeing all of you there. And I'm excited to be going back home for such a time as this. Thank you so much. Just to piggyback on what Janelle was saying, uh, 
So, of course, this is a fundraising event for Mackenzie High School, and we're looking forward to your support. And we can't wait to just for you guys to just come out and have fun. Okay. So, April 21st, Edward Benjamin Building is going to be transformed into a night of no, like, like none other. Excellent. So don't forget, your job at home is to keep an eye out for the website, which will be coming later in February. We're going to, Janelle and Matthew will make sure that everybody gets access to it. So you can go ahead and contribute and purchase your ticket for the gala. And when you do attend, I can't wait to hear all the great, fantastic time you've had. And it will set a precedence for the future galas and reunions to come. So with that said, one thing to remember is nothing can be done without each other. So much blessings and good night.